Python is a non-venomous snake that belongs to the family, Pythonidae. It is mostly found in Asia, Africa and Australia. At present, there are 31 recognized species of python, out of which the reticulated python is the longest snake or reptile in the world. Pythons generally inhabit grasslands, rocky foothills, rainforests, and savannas. They are mostly carnivorous as they generally feed on birds, mammals like monkeys, antelopes, frogs, deer etc. They are constrictors as they wrap their body around their prey and squeeze until the prey stops breathing and die. The feisty python doesn't even flinch before delivering a stinging blow, sinking its sharp, curved teeth into the prey's face. Although pythons are non-venomous and kill their prey through strangulation, those teeth are still capable of causing severe damage. Once they grip their victim, they then wrap their massive bodies around the unlucky animal, cutting off the air supply until the heart stops. Python's flexible jaws also allow them to swallow larger mammals and reptiles like antelope, goats, and crocodiles, also big cat probably wouldn't be too far-fetched. After killing the prey, they swallow it in one piece. Pythons are excellent swimmers and have heat-sensing organs that allow them to see in the dark and thus to locate their prey. They are cold-blooded animals so cannot regulate their body temperature on their own and often increase their body temperature through sunbathing way they are cold. They can measure up to 30 feet in length and weigh around 260 to 300 pounds and can live up to 40 years in captivity. Python and anaconda both are the largest, heaviest and most dangerous snakes in the world. Although they belong to different families of the snake, they share many features and often look alike. People often confuse python with anaconda.
anaconda is one of the heaviest and largest snakes in the world that belongs to the family, Boidae. It is a semi-aquatic snake that is mostly found in tropical South America and generally lives in rivers, swamps and marshes. Anacondas are stocky, muscular snakes often thicker than boas. Their nostrils and eyes are located on the top of their head that allows them to see its prey when submerged in water. The extremely muscular anaconda is a constrictor and has teeth and powerful jaws that it utilizes to clench onto its prey. It grabs its victim and pulls it underwater, drowning the prey, and then swallow them in one piece. Can you tell which is python and which is anaconda in this video? Write in the comments below. The honey badger, also known as the rattle, is a mammal that can be found throughout Africa, Southwest Asia, and India. It is the only member of the Mellivora genus in the Mellivorinae mustelid subfamily. The honey badger, despite its name, is not related to other badger species. Weasels share more anatomical similarities with it. Because of its thick skin, strength, and ferocious defensive abilities, it is primarily a carnivorous species with few natural predators. The honey badger has a relatively long body, but its back is thick set and broad. Its skin is surprisingly supple, allowing it to freely turn and twist within it. An adaptation to fighting conspecifics, the skin around the neck is 6 mm thick. With a short muzzle, the head is small and flat. Another possible adaptation to avoid damage while fighting is that the eyes are small and the ears are little more than ridges on the skin. The honey badger has five toes on each foot and short, sturdy legs. The claws on the feet are extremely strong, with short claws on the hind legs and remarkably long claws on the forelimbs. It's a partially plantigrade creature with thickly padded soles and naked wrists. Except for below the base, the tail is short and covered in long hairs. Honey badgers are mostly solitary 
but they have been seen hunting in pairs in Africa during the breeding season in May. It also makes use of aardvark, warthog, and termite burrows. It is an expert digger, capable of digging tunnels in hard ground in under 10 minutes. These burrows usually have only one entrance, are only 1 to 3 meters long, and have no bedding in the nesting chamber. The honey badger is known for its toughness, ferocity, and strength. When escape is impossible, it is known to attack almost any other species savagely and fearlessly, reportedly even repelling much larger predators such as lions, hyenas, and warthogs. Animal bites, bee stings, and porcupine quills rarely penetrate their skin. A mongoose is any of nearly three dozen species of small bold predatory carnivores found mainly in Africa but also in southern Asia and southern Europe. Mongooses are noted for their audacious attacks on highly venomous snakes, such as king cobras. Mongooses are short-legged animals with pointed noses, small ears, and long furry tails. The claws do not retract, and in most species there are five toes on each foot. The fur is gray to brown and is commonly grizzled or flecked with lighter gray. Markings, when present, include stripes, dark legs, and pale or ringed tails. The mongoose becomes so brave and aggressive to defend itself and or its territory from the lions. It's possible that the mongoose has some pups in the den, and that could be why it is fighting so hard to scare the lions away. Nearly all animals become strangely aggressive when they have young to protect. Time but underneath that they are very strong and can be very aggressive when they need to be. Please click the like button and subscribe to our channel Wildlife TV for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.